Hey everybody, welcome to another Dark and Light video. Today we have a lot to talk about because a lot has changed in game and outside of game. So the first thing you might notice is my camera is different and I'll tell you guys why. Um, I got a new, I got a second monitor, right? So now I have this monitor in front of me, but I also have a monitor right where I'm looking right there. So now my recording and, and editing and stuff is going to be on this screen, which I'm looking at, which you can't see. And then I'm going to be playing the game on this screen, but that means I obviously moved my camera. Now, this isn't the final position. This is kind of just like testing, but uh, tell me if you guys like it. Um, I think it's okay. I don't like the angle very much, but um, just tell me what you guys think. But also, a lot has changed in-game because so far, every episode, i kind of just been playing like normal. But between this episode and last episode, I've done hours and hours of farming, so I've got a lot of stuff to show you. Also, I've leveled, like, everything, so we have a lot to craft and upgrade. I've pretty much leveled everything, and I just haven't done anything with it, because I wanted to wait until this episode. But, let's go take a look at a few things. But here's what I'm going to do. Um, I kind of lied a little bit. So, while I was grinding and farming, I did record a little bit, because two important things happened. So, my Bargesh died, right? So... In the clip you're about to see, I tamed a Bargesh, which I'm not going to show, but I got a turkey, and I tamed a Longhorn. I, forgot, I don't think it's a Kebo. It's a Longhorn. So, here's that footage right now. Okay, so there you saw me taming him. Let's actually go take a look at him. I also built like a higher wall. I gotta not let the turkey get out. But yeah, so we tamed this longhorn and we got a turkey. I didn't know turkeys were in this game, but apparently they are. So if we go into here, we can make eggs and it's already made some eggs. Now, I have no idea what these are actually used for. You can just feed it berries. Um, let's give it... Um, what does this even turkey need? What does a turkey need? I guess we'll just give it weight and health. But, um, yeah. And then I got a lot of grass, so I started grinding for some fur. So all these sheep have a bunch of fur on them. Yeah. And then, of course, I got the big boy, the longhorn, which will help us farm, hopefully. Can I get on top of my roof? Oh, how sick would that be? Can I get on top of my roof? Oh, I can't. So like, can I like jump over this wall to get too straight over here? Okay, I can't. Maybe, maybe if I make it, if I get another creature that's a little bit taller. But let's go take a look at some of my other tames, because these are a little bit more important. So my Bargish died, so I went to get a new one, and then I actually saw the turkey in the Longhorn while I was doing it. But uh, and I accidentally clicked follow all, so like all my creatures are like stuck inside my door. But um. I think I got a new boar too. I don't know if this is the same boar. I don't... No, it's Tusker. Okay, this is the same boar. Our boar hasn't died yet. And I used him for farming. And of course, we still have that one vulture. We had two last episode, but one of them died. But here is the new Bargesh, level 45. Our other one was like 20-something. Or it, it was a lot lower, but I, I tamed a pretty high-level Bargesh, which is nice. So this guy is a lot stronger than our other one. Yeah, I tamed this guy, and then, of course, I tamed the Longhorn and the Turkey. Okay, so this episode is going to focus a lot on crafting. By the way, if you just saw me look over there, my camera is usually over here, so that's just a force of habit. But, um, yeah, what we're going to focus on today is a lot of, like, magic and building, and especially we got uh, copper and iron and stuff now. Let's go over here. If we go to our survival... I ended up unlocking the bigger chests, uh, the stone fireplace, the canopy, and the telescope. So, let's go in here, and I'll actually show you. I had to add more chests, because I got too much material. Look at this. Also, another kind of thing that I have to tell you guys about. So, it was weird. I was walking through town collecting gold from the little presents to give to the NPCs to level them up. And I walked towards the renting area, and there was two dead NPCs randomly. They were just dead. I have no idea why. But I stole their armor. Oh, I thought there was something in here for a second. 
So one uh, NPC had craftable ice wind tunic. So this protects against uh, fire, I think. Hot, right? And then the other one had this stuff. The craftable ice wind shoes. And prom yeah. Rolls wearing the suit. Yeah, so I don't know. We had this clothing, which is kind of interesting. And yeah, I don't know if that does anything, but we got some materials here. Got some materials here. Got some materials here. I got a lot of farming done. Whatever we need to build, we're definitely going to build it today. So I guess let's start off with the chest. So what I'm going to do, since I don't want to break all these because there's so much material, I'm just going to build chests over here. So I'm going to kind of move my storage area. But let's see, what do we need for the chests? What are we going to need? Now, I lost where the chests were. But they should be... Where they should... Oh, right here. Okay, so we need copper, twine, wood. And I'm pretty sure we got a good bit of copper in here. And we're going to need to go get more. That's... was We're going to need to get more. But when I farmed, I mostly focused on wood and twine. Not exactly on the ore. But we'll have enough ore for now. I think what I'm going to need more is twine. There we go. So let's see how many we can build here. We can build nine. All right, let's build all nine for now. And then we'll place them down. One quick thing, though, that's kind of very annoying. If you guys see the turkey through the wall, for some reason, I don't know if this is a glitch or I'm doing something wrong, but turkeys don't have the wandering mode off. Like, all these animals, you can turn wandering off so they stay in still. The turkey doesn't have that. I tr it's Right now, it's on no wander, and it's still wandering. So it's quite weird. Let's go ahead and actually start placing these. Ooh, I just, like, dived. Can we put... We can, like, stick these half inside the wall. And now, we're gonna come to the point where I play the real game. I'm actually gonna start organizing stuff. So, each chest is gonna be for a specific item. None of that messy stuff anymore. And I'll obviously do the organ organization off-screen, because that's gonna take forever. But, um... I'm really, really excited to get... Th Why do I keep doing that? I'm really, really excited to get these chests already because I've been waiting pretty much all these levels just for just for the chests because there's no really use organizing the small chests, but now you guys can call me out in the comments. I have no excuse. I have these chests. Now, this might be a little too close, but I I'll, I'll know where the boundaries are, so I'll be fine. Let's go ahead and place this one. And then we're going to have a lot of stuff, so I'm going to have a bunch of rows of these. For now, I only have one more, though, so I'll just place one more. Just like that. Yeah, these can hold a good bit more. Not, like, a huge amount, but a good bit more. Okay, my camera's still in place. So let's see, what else did I unlock? I know I unlocked a lot of, like, steel weapons, which I guess we'll make some here. Um, let's see, what is, what is it that I have to craft for it? It's not the armor. I think it's this. We have to craft the dining table. No, that's just the dining table. Where is the, it's not the fireplace. It's not the cooking pot. It's this. I need to get these two. So, copper, hide, wood, and stone. You know what I'm about to do? Let's just take a bunch of material. Let's take a bunch of this, a bunch of this. A lot of twine. Let's just take a bunch of material out of all kinds. Oh, I don't need those shoes. And then let's just craft whatever we need to. Uh, I don't think I need any of that stuff. We need some hide. We're going to need some fur. We're going to need a little, little bit of this. Oh, I think I'm full. Okay, let's take that out. All right, let's see. So we're going to need... This is the workbench, right? Build one of those. And then, where's the grinding wheel? The grinding, what do I need? Oh, I need some of, I need some of the rare stone. I know I have a, I have a lot of that. There's some in here. But I know I have some in some other chest. I just gotta find it. I'm kinda stuck in place right now. Okay, so let's come over here. Got enough stone for that, or the rare stone. And pretty much, that's all kinda we need right now. But I guess we can build the f stone fireplace. What is this? Compost bin. Um, I guess let's get a compost bin real quick. Do I need anything else? Just kind of... What is this? Curing rack. Let's get one of those. Let's pretty much get all, like, the crafting items. Just might as well get them. 
so we can kind of get it over with. But I think, ooh, I can move. Okay, cool. Let's place this. How do I turn it? I know there's a way to turn it. Okay, so there is our workbench. It's a little far out than I wanted, but oh well. Now, how big is this? Oh, this is really, really small. I, did, I thought it was a lot bigger than that. Guess we'll just put that there. Uh, this, I'm pretty sure it's pretty big. I don't even need this. I don't even know why I made this. Can we, like, shove it back here somewhere? No. Maybe. Can I stick this one outside? Maybe just put this, like... No, I don't want to... Can I... Is there, like, flat ground anywhere? Yeah, I'm just going to put it right here. Bam. I don't know what's that used for or what do I even need it for, but we'll just place that right there. Curing rack... Oh, I can just place it back here, apparently. Okay, cool. And I can still get to this, right? Yeah. So what does this make? Oh, okay, so it's other stuff. Maybe, is it just more efficient than this one? I have no idea. Now, is there anything else? We got the fireplace, although this is probably a mistake to make. This is huge, and I don't really need it. We could place it, like, right here. Oh, okay. I can just pretty much get rid of this then, right? Uh, let's just demolish this. Is something killing my creatures? Oh, no, you don't. There you are. You're not doing nothing to my animals. Come here. Come here, you stupid bargash. Get out of here. Get out of here. Okay. The turkey is safe, guys. Don't worry. The turkey is safe. Okay, cool. So, we did all that. Now, this is what I was getting to in the original place. So, now that we got this, we can make a lot of these, like, better equipment. So, uh, we're going to get rid of our stone stuff, pretty much. We could have iron axe and iron pickaxe. Now, they're not not—they're actually not too bad. They're pretty much just one iron ingot. And then the crossbow, which will replace our bow, pretty much. Daggers, long swords. What is this? That's a stone feeding trough. Okay, so what do we need? Hide and wood. Okay, so let's go ahead and take the iron out of here. And then we need wood. Wood and hide, right? Wood and hide. Where's more wood? I know there's some more wood in here. No, not in there. In here, maybe? There we go. Oof, I'm slow. Okay, we can just reach up from here. Pretty sure, can we just place it right in here, right? Bam. Make, let's make three of those, and then one, two, three. Okay, and that's pretty much all we needed. I don't, I don't really need, okay, actually, let's get some twine, though. Oop, I actually have twine in my inventory. Let me stick that in there. Let's make one of these. And I'm not going to craft this armor. Oh, one of the probably biggest things that I did forget is the armor that I'm wearing now. I got mithril armor. You might be wondering, isn't mithril, like, tier 2? Like, isn't it better than even iron? And I only have copper right now? Yeah, it is. Um, it's one of the, another one of those situations where I actually saw a villager die, and he had this on him. There's another creature outside. And I was like, oh, okay, well, I'll just steal your armor. Come on, why are there so many creatures out? You, you you stop it. Well, this one's a level 43. This one's a good Bargesh. But, um, I'm not going to bother taming it now because I have a good one. But, yeah, it was another situation. Why? Why is there so many Bargeshes around? But it's okay. I'll kill it with my crossbow later on. But for now, why? These are pretty high level. 39? They actually, they have, like, a chance of killing. Let's eat some food real quick. And is there another one over here? I swear I saw one. Looming. Is one over here? Maybe not. He got lucky. So I would I would have killed him. But okay, let's go check back on our iron tools. Let's see how that's going. What is this? Oh, it goes through the house. <laughs> oh, I didn't realize the fireplace did that. But we do need some lighting in here. So let's. Do we have? Do I have some more wood? So we can place that in there, right? And bam. So it's just like a campfire, but now it's like more... Okay, so let's check on our stuff. Look at these beautiful weapons. Real quick, 
I'm gonna drop some stuff off. And of course, I will organize probably my next cut. But real quick, I wanna take a look at these weapons. Oh, I just turned it off. Turn back on. Let's take a look at these weapons. They're beautiful. So, yeah, durability 50 out of 50. How much durability does these have? 12. So these are like three or four times better. That's crazy. Alright. So here's the thing about the crossbow though. It's more powerful. It has more durability. The thing is it, have to be, it has to be reloaded after every shot. The bow I think is a bit quicker. So I might keep both. So like my screen's a little bit like blocked. What I'm going to do is I'm going to add the crossbow next to the bow. I'm still going to keep the bow on us. And then this stuff is just going to go away. I'm not going to use stone anymore. There's no reason to still use stone. I could even make a sword. Copper. Okay, maybe I should do that. Is my copper in here? Where? Did, oh, do I still have my copper? Is that all the copper that I have? Don't tell me I used all. Of it. Okay, well, when we get some more copper, we'll make the sword itself. But for now, we're fine with this stuff. And what is this? This is a reindeer saddle. Kevo saddle, which we'll need later. Copper helm. Okay, some pretty cool stuff. But for now, guys, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to organize... I'm going to make more and organize these chests real quick. And let's get my health up, I guess. And then, yeah, I'll show you guys my prop. Okay, guys, so I have an update. So, obviously, all of these are gone. They're not here anymore. And I have all the chests here. And I'll kind of go through them. So, we got a straw chest, a wood slash twine, a stone slash sulfur, saddle, weapons and tools, drops and crystals, powders and magic, ore, food slash meat, structures, miscellaneous, and trash. So, we can go through all these, see all the magic stuff is here. All, like, the animal drops and crystals and stuff like that's here. This is armors, saddles, weapons and tools, all the wood, twine, all variations, stone, sulfur, all variations, and coal. Uh, we got some straw, which I need to collect, actually. I got food slash meat, ore, which we don't have too much. So right now, these are mostly empty, just because uh, I guess I didn't do as much farming as I thought. But, I, I mean, to be fair, these took a lot of wood, twine, and copper. And I still got some stuff. Oopsies. I keep doing that by accident. I need to stop doing that. But we still got some stuff in here. And we still got some stuff in here. But I'll just leave that chilling for now. But, guys, something that I want to do. I kind of want to test out my longhorn to see how it does things. So I need to go to my structure. See, power of organization. I'll grab my walls, put those at zero, and let's go out. Let's grab the longhorn. All right, you know what? We can also test out, ooh, the crossbow. One. Okay, so it's a little bit slow, but the crossbow works. Let's get our, I guess, sword out for now. Let's go in here. Ugh. The one thing that sucks about the longhorn is every time I want to get it out, I'm going to have to break a wall pretty much. So I'll demolish that one. I'm just hoping the turkey doesn't escape. I kind of just like back, back it out like a truck. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, no, 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 no. No, you stay in there. And I'll just do that. And that will keep them safe for now. Okay, so let's kind of go out and see what this thing can do. Now, obviously, this, this thing has a giant... Okay, so it can mine stone pretty well. That's pretty good. I needed something to mine stone. How's this wood? Okay. So, okay, so it pretty much just demolishes everything in its path. Now, its stamina is super low. I'm kind of getting the idea. And its weight is pretty good I mean it's this thing's gigantic it should have a high weight but yeah it, this boy's stamina is not very good I mean it comes back pretty quickly but yeah um I'm kind of tempted to put it up against the hyena I guess let's go see I might get this thing killed right here but you know what? If something happens, I'll go in and fight. Okay, yeah, come on. It'd be nice if I could just maybe get one of them. You're gonna attack me, or? Okay, that's actually not. It's not bad. Okay, they killed one. Okay, that's not that bad actually. Now I need to like get around to killing. Okay, come on. 
Okay, there we go. It's like, this thing's gonna kill me if I can't turn around. Okay, not too bad. Alright, you wanna die too? Now, where do you think you're going? Okay, that one's dead. Okay. Um, that's not terrible. I mean, it survived, but it lost a good bit of health. Probably a little bit more health than it should have lost. I mean, I think the main thing I'm gonna use this for is, like, rock gathering, because I don't... But at this point, I'm trying to think. Let's get out. I'm pretty sure one of these acts is honestly just better. Yeah, I could run around a little bit quicker and get more rocks. So, for now, this boy isn't really going to have much use. But, um, it's good to have at least. This is kind of like a cool attack. But it's good to have at least for now. But, yeah. It's not super duper useful. Okay, now, this turkey needs to go away, man. Come. Yes, go away. Let's demolish that wall. Get this boy back in here. Bam. Bam, there we go. Alright, cool. Well, that is the Longhorn. What is... Is that just a rock? Okay. I was like, what is this? And is there anything in here? There's not. But what we probably should do is grab all this fur. Some of these... Yeah, I think most of these sheep are actually still making fur. That's how long it takes. I've been playing hours and hours, and most of these sheep are still at it. But let's make sure to take all these out. And do we still have food in here? Yeah, we still have food. And, of course, I'm going to go put this back. What does this do? What is this? A small fertilizer. Oh, it just takes... Okay, so grass and that, which is kind of cool. But here, I'll show you the power of organization. I'll just go over here. Bam. Drops and crystals. It goes right in here. Stone and sulfur goes right in here. Just like that. Twine goes in here. And straw goes in here. Bam. Just like that. Okay, guys. Another thing that we probably should do is make some more Burunda saddles. So let's get a bunch of this stuff. And what else do I need? I just need twine. Right. So let's get some twine. Bam, bam. Let's see. How many can we make? We can craft two. All right. Let's just craft two of them. Just because those things are kind of... I'll just say dispensable, like, I'm gonna kill a lot of vultures. Oh god, that is a lot. I mean, yeah, that's why I made that sheep farm early on, because I know sulf or fur is gonna be something that we're definitely gonna need. Now, stuff like this claws, I still don't know what I'm really- what it's used for, but, yeah. Okay, guys, so here's what I'm gonna do. For now, I'm gonna put the saddles back in here, but... Pretty much, I'm just going to end off the episode. Most of the stuff that I'm showing you guys is kind of more updates, but I want to do one thing. I do want to get one more vault. Okay, guys, so I'm actually preparing myself. I'm making a bunch of stone hook arrows. I've got my trough, and I kind of just remember that rotten meat, you can actually feed to the vultures. It doesn't have to actually be raw meat, which I kind of completely forgot about. But yeah, do I have any more twine in here? I don't. Okay. Well, pretty much, we're going to go out right after this. I think I made 33, right? So, one more. Bam, and then we could place this stuff back in here. And then we'll just keep the twine on us. Let's make sure we have these arrows on here. Because I don't want to shoot them with real arrows, because I'll probably kill them. But yeah, let's go out and look for a vulture. Oh, we just got staffs level 2, the druidic staff. Okay, we might make that. But first, I think we have to clear this place of spiders. I hate spiders. Alright, come here. I'm just gonna kill you just right up close. Bam, you're dead. I can even kill these things. These guys actually have some drops that I need. Oh, it actually hit me. Look at you, big guy. But yeah, give me your feet. Just kind of disturbing, actually, that I just stole his feet. Let's see, there's a griffin there. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to stick my arrows on the crossbow and then my torpor arrows on that. Okay, let's take let's take down this griffin. I don't want this bothering us. Come here, you. Got it. Ooh, this thing is tough. Wow. Okay, you're going to need to go away, though. Oof. Okay, where are you? Where are you? Gone. Wait, what? You didn't die? Can you stop that? I was like, say, please. I mean, I guess he killed this for us. I'll take his feet, too. 
but yeah i definitely need griffins out of the way while taming because they will cause me a good bit of trouble let's see if i can find a vulture another creature that we probably should tame at some point is a kebo one of these things but they're just a lot harder because they take so much materials and stuff okay I'm, did a what just died is that a vulture did you just kill my vulture if you just killed a vulture i'm not gonna be happy with you okay ah uh, that was a vulture no i needed that okay oh well okay no don't tell me the griffin's attacking me is a griffin seriously attack oh that's level 58 that's no bueno uh i need wow i can't believe they're both attacking me i really need them to attack each other there we go there we go the griffin is on the ele rock elemental now you turn around to fight the griffin please why is he after me that doesn't make any sense okay okay no, he's still after me. I was going to say, I think he just... Okay, there is a vulture right there. Why is this... Oh, this earth elemental is dead. That keyboard is right there. Okay, let's try to take this thing down. Okay, level... Oh, that's a really weak one. Oh, well, let's just do it anyway. It'll be a really quick, easy tame. It could be like a disposable bird. Okay, now I need you to fall. That should be enough arrows to take it down. These guys don't need many arrows. There we go. Let's get this down. This should this should be a fairly quick tame. Um, let's give it some meat. There we go. Okay, now we just gotta play the waiting game on this one. All right, guys, do you guys want to try something exciting? Maybe we should try to take down a wyvern. It's just an idea. I don't have saddles for them yet, but maybe, maybe we could try it out. What level? Level six. Okay, this one's doable. Okay, let's see if I can get it to stay down. That's one, two. Oh, I think it got away. Did it get away? Maybe it'll drop. I no, I think it got away. Yep, it got away. There's another Brunda. I wonder. Can we get a double here? There, okay, I'm going to try to get it close over here to the other one. Maybe we can get a double here. Okay, fall. There we go. Bam. Let's get another arrow into you. Yeah, we'll be able to get a double. Is this one? Yeah, this one's taming. All right, cool. That's perfect. Now, they're both really low leveled. But right now, I pretty much need disposable birds. I know that sounds really terrible, but I pretty much just need disposable birds that I can kind of fly around and die if i need to exploring now if i get like a really high level one of these then of course i'm not going to just kill it do i dare do the legendary tr all right there's one of them hopefully okay i need you to uh can you uh no i need him to stay oh oh he must have fell asleep okay can i do the legendary triple I wonder if they attack each other. Uh, You know what? I'm not going to take the chance at it. I'm scared if I aggro the Burunda, he's actually going to attack my creature. And then I'll lose both of my low-leveled ones. So while this one's kind of knocked out, I'll just take care of this one. All right, we got the second Burunda. Just accept it. All right, we got both of them. Follow. Okay, perfect. Nice. Now I just got to get them home. Without being killed. Let's demolish this. Just get him home without being killed. And then we're good. Oh, I just turned on my location. How did I do that? That was by accident. Oh, oh my god. One of them fell asleep, didn't you? Did you fall asleep? Oh, what did I do? Yeah, it looks like he fell asleep. Alright, I think he's up. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. And pretty much all I have to avoid on the way there is a griffin. Basically. Basically just avoid a griffin and we're good. Okay, a spider could cause some trouble. But maybe... Maybe we could go around. Oh no, it's a reaper. 
Oh god, these things are gonna kill my Brundas. No! Stop that! No, they're gonna kill it! Oh god, they're gonna kill it. They're gonna kill it. They're gonna kill it. Oh god, he killed my Brunda. No, okay, I still have one. I still have one. God, I knew they would do that. Why do these things have to come in in the worst times? Oh, he's gonna hit me! Okay, I'm pretty sure they're close enough to attack, though. God, that's so annoying, though. Okay, uh, let's go back out. You know what? Let's go park this Brunda right now. Ah, uh, but of course I lost one of them. That's really annoying. Seems like I can never get my Brundas back in here safely. No! No, please. Please let me get on you. Fly away, fly away, fly away, fly away, fly away. I saved it. Okay, good. If this Brunda was gonna die, I was gonna say, I just, I literally just lost two Brundas. How stupid is that? Okay. This one is safe. And then you, I think he's on stay. Okay. Let's close the door. And where did, where did he go? Okay, I don't know what happened to him, but. Ugh, that's so tilting. Literally, did they just, like, slaughter everything in their path? Man, I'm telling you, these creatures, they're ruthless. Alright, well, let's go get our stuff. And, of course, the re Reaper disappeared. So, um... I can't even pick up the Reaper's items, I'm pretty sure, because it's gone. That's really dumb. The least I could have done is grab the Reaper's items. But nope, they disappeared. Alright, although we lost one, it was the lower health one at least. And we did get a... Okay, guys, I think that's going to be it for today's episode. And I'm still looking over there. Such a force of habit. But, yeah, I think that's going to be it for today. I'm still kind of really disappointed that we didn't get that third Barunda. I'm probably still saying that wrong. But, um... I guess some things can't really be avoided in this situation. Maybe next episode we'll go exploring. Maybe that could be an idea. But for sure, between next episode and this episode, I'm going to be doing some farming, gathering some items, and then we'll have some fun next episode. And actually, I just thought right before we end this episode, right, right before we end it, is it in here? Yes, let's eat these. Will that get me to the next? It won't. It'll get, only get me to 48, but I know Goblin Engineering. I did get the first one now, so I can make these, but I mean, I don't think they're really worth it. But uh, yeah, guys, if you enjoyed today's episode, make sure to like and comment as it was on the channel, and I will see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye.